So there are quite a few players trying to bring some form of Linux onto Android devices, since, after all, Android runs on a Linux kernel. One that's looking very promising is Lindroid. And yes, this is a happy topic, not one of there hacking. You <laughs> oh, Kagani, you have to hack it to use it. You have to yes, root your phone. So. You do, actually, but this is happy hacking. Okay. <laughs> so if you want a containerized version of Linux on your mobile phone, this might be a great uh, tool for you. Lindroid is stating they have a hardware accelerated version of Linux working on Android. And it uses Wayland. It's, it's the only one I know of that's really using Wayland right now. So currently, you will need to put your hacker hat on as your device will need to be rooted. But those things can change as it gets more mature, which is so true. They were going to make this process easier, I'm sure. So many of you out there are old school Android rooters, so it won't be a problem for you. And like for me and Michael and Ryan, uh, we've done I've rooting been our phones. devices before you were even born. <laughs> I've been rooting them since Unix. Been, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. We're a rooting, tooting bunch. Of, <laughs> we root everything. I root yeah. everything. I don't care why. I rooted in my refrigerator. I root it. It doesn't even have a smart yeah. device in it. Just had rooted it anyway. Just rooted it. Rooted yeah. You figure out how, <laughs> and then you can root yours. Yeah. Yeah. So we have a ask uh, for everyone out in the community. If you use Lindroid, uh, we would love to hear from you and what you loved about it and how well does it actually work for you. Because it, it's still very much a work in progress. And yeah. so it, it mm -hmm. takes a bit of 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 going through all the instructions and and doing some compiling and and whatnot. But uh, random side note: we were talking about. <laughs> I just made that ridiculous joke about hacking a fridge. I kind of want to hack my microwave because <laughs> I I hate my microwave because like there's you know how like some microwaves you just click one of the numbers and it's like oh two two minutes one button this. This one I have now does not do that. You have to put the regular thing like a like a like a savage barbarian. You have to type <laughs> two, zero, two zero 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 start. Oh my god! Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Exactly. Why don't I just cook it over a campfire or dig exactly. a hole in the dirt and just put some coal in there and cover it back <laughs> up? Like why don't I you get it? Brick yep, you oven. Get it. If I have to push three buttons, uh, I literally looked up to see if I could change this. I cannot. <laughs> So oh. sad. You can hack it with a Raspberry <laughs> Pi. I'm sure someone in our community will tell you how. You know, I, I mean, it wasn't one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> yeah, you, you, you got this, Michael. I want, I yeah. want to know. I want an update next week of how you've hacked this thing. There's got to be something, even if it's as dumb <laughs> as putting like a little plastic thing that you glue to the three buttons that you need for two minutes that you push, and it just yeah. gives you a few minutes. You've got to come up with some hack by next week, even if it's dumb. For how you can make it so you only have to push once. So like right. I would have to basically make it where there's like one prong is longer than the other prong. So it hits it in an order. It's like boom, 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 boom. Yes. Like something, uh, you know, or, or you could electronically hack it or I mean, whatever. I sort of, I did a workaround because it's like two minutes. No, no, if, no. It's for next week. You shut it. Whatever the trick is, it's next week. Oh. We'll give it the microwave <laughs> yeah, hack. We're going to save this super important information. Yeah, for, if you want to know. How to save half a millisecond. You got to tune in next week. Hit that subscribe button, people. Because I, I retroactive, retro hacked my, or yeah. analog hacked my analog microwave. Hacked it. Still That's a hack, cool, right, Michael. Jill? Yes, absolutely. It's like back in the day with uh, uh, DVD players to make them region free so I could play my British DVDs. Oh my gosh, Jill, will you please quit telling us about your crimes? All right. <laughs> <laughs>